Hey everyone, as you can see, I'm actually not at 24 hour fitness and working out, but I'm traveling for work in Des Moines, Iowa, and found a YMCA, a brand new one, and was able to incorporate my leg day. And uh, this is actually in the evening, this is around 5 o'clock in the evening, and typically I work out at 1 o'clock in the morning or 2 o'clock in the morning. So this is kind of a new experience to actually have, you know, a good amount of food in me. Actually, it's kind of a weird thing because I was traveling this day. Other than that, I was able to hit my 225 5x5. And although I was in a different environment, still feeling really good about the weight. Um, you know, outside of this weird setup for the squat rack and trying to set that up appropriately um, to be able to properly re-rack. And then I move over to sumo deadlifts. This is something that I, like I said in previous videos, I'm going to incorporate these a lot more than conventional deadlifts. Um, I just feel like I can really maximize the posterior chain as I use this lift. So I go ahead and do 225 and feel really good, especially with the grip strength as well. And then I move up to 245, feeling pretty bold. And I was like, oh, this is pretty, pretty easy. So. Um, you know, as far as my grip strength, I was pretty surprised that I can actually uphold my grip strength uh, for this 245. And I didn't have my straps with me, so, you know, I actually went a little heavier as well. Went up to 275 uh, for five reps, and just to see if I could do it. And I was able to do it. So um, I'm hoping that I can take this home, even though the 24 hour fitness has like the octagon weights I'm not a big fan of that as far as doing this movement securely and safely but right now 275 is my PR as far as it comes down to with not utilizing straps and so I continue to push forward with this lift and then I'm actually gonna move over to fantastic RDLs as well and then I start off pretty light with the RDLs just because I didn't have my weight belt and I didn't have any straps. And I just want to make sure that I'm doing the right range of motion, right movement um, before I go any heavier. Uh, and then I go up to 185 and then I go up to 205 and then 225 within this movement. But all in all, this is actually a really good gym um, as far as I could just stay in this one area and get all my lifts in um, for leg day. And this was actually a pretty busy gym as well during this time, but nobody was bothering me. I just got my workout done and was able to complete this in a timely manner. And if there's any questions, any critiques that you guys have, definitely leave them in the comments below. But I appreciate all your support. Feeling good about all these movements so far. And if there's anything that you guys um, have questions about leave them in, in the comments below as well, and I'll address them But thanks for all your support. Thanks for watching and have a good one. Bye-bye